China Communist Party Congress, a really simple guy. China's ruling Communist Party is expected to hang a third five-year term to Xi Jinping, argu arguably the most powerful Chinese leader since Mao Zedong in the 1917. The decision will further thinking his grip on China. It is possible that Mr. Xi 69 will remain in power for the rest of the, his life. The history move is due at the Communist Party Congress underway in Beijing, one of the most important meetings in the party history. Xi Jinping currently holds three top positions. As General Secretary, he is the chief of the China Communist Party. As President, he is China's head of state. As chairman of China's Central Military Commission, he commands the country's armed force. He is also referred to as a paramount or supreme leader. Mr. Xi is likely to retain the first two titles, Party General Secretary and Central Military Commission Chairman and the Party Congress, which take place every five years, and the Presidency and the Annual National People's Congress in Spring 2023. What happens in the Congress? Some 203 So, what happens on the Congress? Some 203, no, 2,300 delegates had gathered in Tiananmen Square's Great Hall of the People for a week. About 200 of them will be selected to join the party central committee, plus around uh, 170 alternate members. The central committee with the leg 25 people to the party's Politburo. And the Politburo will appoint the members of the Politburo Standing Committee. These are the elite of the elite. There are currently seven members, including the party general secretary Xi Jinping. They are all men. Not all of the action take place on the Congress itself. The Central Committee is expected to meet the day after the main congress ends. Why is this, it is important? Mr. Xi leads the world's second largest economy and one of these biggest military force. Some analysts say he is likely to push China towards a more authoritarian political stance in their five years term. China under Xi is moving in a totalitarian direction, says Professor Steve Sang of London University School of Oriental and African Studies. So as China under Mao was a totalitarian system. We're not there yet, but we're moving in that direction. Professor Sang says the Congress could see change to the party's constitution with Xi Jinping thought being further enshrined as the party guiding philosophy. Xi Jinping thought is Mr. Xi brand of Chinese socialism, an assertively nationalist philosophy which is highly sceptical of private business. Under his leadership, the Chinese authority had cracked down on powerful companies in several sectors of the economy. If that happens, they effectively make him a dictator. Dictator, Prof. Sen says. If that happens, they effectively make him a dictator. Prof. Sen says. Henry Wiyago Wang, former counselor to the State Council of China, insists that Mr. Xi should be credited with building his country into a prosperous, modernized society. China has its unique way, he says. Beijing is trying to have a consult consultative democracy, not a an American meritocracy. 
China tops leadership team to be available on the Congress will set a huge range of policies. Any hint of China's future direction will be followed closely around the world, particularly on the key challenges economic, political, diplomatic, and environmental.